What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Caps and sides everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. I was about to go to bed, um, but I received a channel, um, and it's Holy crap. Okay, so it's for somebody out there. And I know I didn't hear say it on here, but I intuitively am going to feel guided to do it because of the channel. Um, I We have made great, great strides on this channel in the almost two years I've had it to prevent people from being taken advantage of from hitting cameras in their home. And I am so proud of that. I am so, so proud of that. Um, I am. Uh, when I went full time with this in the summertime, there was almost a thousand of you guys, almost a thousand. I'm not um, inflating that number. I'm serious as a heart attack about that. Contact me. Pictures of the hidden cameras. Texts that you found hidden cameras. I mean, emails and texts and almost a thousand of them. So we have made huge, great strides on here to protect people's safety from vultures and narcissistic energies and energy energy succubuses and i'm so proud about that but um so i'm going to deliver the channel message it's a free general collective reading um it's very important to only take the messages that resonate leave the rest okay so the channel message i received was um <clears throat> someone that lives outside of your area um i heard a distance a distance um i heard air sign and fire sign energy there's that's confirmation for my intuitive kitty. And he meowed in the last reading. That was confirmation. He has not done it since. And now he's meowing again. Confirmation. Just saying, just saying. Come on. And it's not fat boy. He's laying right there. Holy crap. So you plug it in, how it resonates. But anyway, so the channel message I received was um, someone that lives at a distance from you, her air sign and fire sign energy. So Aries Leo Sag, Gemini Libra Aquarius energy. Um, is about to send you communication soon um, regarding confirmation that there really was a hidden camera in your home. Um, that's what I heard. Um, and, I, and I got another one, um, which is, it might be related. For some of you guys, it might not. I don't know. The other one's pretty wackadoo, and I don't, it's wackadoo, but I'll deliver it. It is what it is. But that one's wonderful. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So somebody's about to get confirmation from somebody that lives a distance from them i think they might have viewed in on the camera and maybe didn't know it was dark web activities or something like that um or they just are regretful i'm not sure but i feel you're either an air sign or a fire sign or an air sign or a fire sign is going to connect with you through some kind of communication um i'm feeling snail mail email text or messenger or something like that um, letting you know about this. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, like I said, I feel you could either be an air sign or a fire sign or air sign or fire sign is going to communicate with you. They live at a distance from you though. That was specific from the spiritual realm. They live at a distance from you. So they do not live in your community. They do not live in your city, your town, your province, etc., etc., etc. They live a distance from you. So, or you could be the air sign or fire sign delivering this communication to somebody. You plug it in how it resonates, but that's wonderful that you're going to, if you are the one about to deliver this communication, that's wonderful that you're about to do this because you may give somebody proof for a lawsuit. And I'm serious about that. Um, so kudos to you, whoever you are. Um, that's wonderful. And kudos to the person about to receive this communication um, because I, you, for some, I feel you have been waiting for this for a long freaking time. So kudos. Okay, so the other one, he's at it again. Come on, baby. It's just me here. And now he's going off the chain. Come on, baby. Come on. Okay, so the other one I received was, um, and it's so freaking wackadoo. I don't know how this person, this person doesn't have the right mental facets, I'll tell you that. Whoever this is. Um, I heard a very, very codependent water sign, feminine, is in a false marriage with a fire sign femme. <laughs> it, it, gets, it gets crazier. <laughs> And I heard they are um, 
they expect this far sign femme to take care of them. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. And then it was like 45 seconds to a minute after that, I heard they're going to try to attempt to cause huge chaos in this fire sign feminine's life, but it's about to back energetically backfire on them in a huge way. So you plug it in how it resonates. Now that's a crazy, crazy, I mean, okay, let's dissect that one. They're in a false marriage. So the fire sign femme didn't even agree to be in the marriage. It's two feminine energies. I've, I heard a very codependent fire, um, water sign femme is in a false marriage with a fire sign femme. So they probably frauded her signature or had somebody else fraud her signature. But the fire sign femme obviously does not know she's in a false marriage with this codependent water sign femme because she never agreed to be in the marriage. And the thing is, is with marriages, you have to be in your complete mental facets to even get married. Um, but they're not, I heard they're not even married. It's a false marriage. I heard they expect this codependent, um, fire sign them expects the fire sign to take care of them. You don't get in marriages to have somebody take care of you. If you're the fire, uh, water sign them, just let you know. I don't know who the hell this is for, but it's so wackadoo. I don't know how you were raised or who the hell convinced you to do this shit. Or maybe you convinced yourself to do it. I don't know if you were the fire sign, wackadoo, uh, codependent, water sign them. I mean, I don't know why I'm getting the spiritual download. It's so fucking crazy. But they need to go get a job is what they need to do. And leave people alone with false marriages is what they need to do. Um, maybe maybe this, maybe this, she watches. I don't know. Um, if you watch, go get a job. Go get a job and leave people the hell alone. Because I, I heard the water sign, codependent water sign film expects this fire sign film to take care of her. You don't get into marriages to have people expect to take care of you. Just a little FYI, we live in 2022, not 1902. Just saying, just saying. Um, that's the craziest damn thing I think I've ever heard of in my whole damn life. And I'm serious about that. Um, there's a reason I'm pulling the message in. I feel she might watch. If you watch Codependent Water Sign, go get a job and burn the marriage certificate. Just let you know. Because it's obvious, it's false anyways. So when you, tr um, I heard you're going to try to attempt ca to cause chaos. If you watch Codependent Water Sign Femme, you're going to try to attempt to cause chaos in this Fire Sign Femme's life. Well, one, you obviously don't love her. I'll tell you that. It's two Femme energy. You don't love her. You just want money. So go get a damn job and get your own money. And leave people alone and quit trying to cause chaos. I feel like I need a disclaimer that for somebody. Because how do you think codependent water sign film, if you watch, how do you think that this fire sign would feel when she finds out you put her in a false marriage? She ain't gonna be happy. She ain't gonna be happy. Nay, nay. Nobody would be happy. And then she probably placed a lawsuit on your ass. Because if it was me, that's exactly what the hell I would do. And I'm just being serious about that. So. If I was you, codependent water sign femme, I would burn the fucker and move on with your life and go get a job. And I'm just being for real about that. I'm serious. I feel somebody needs to hear the harsh reality and truth of things, codependent water sign femme, if you um, watch. And I'm serious about that because you should, you don't marry somebody to expect them to take care of you. I never married my husband to expect him to take care of me, my ex-husband. That's not why we got married, just let you know. And we've been divorced a long time. And I'm serious about that. Um, so that's what I would do. I would burn the fucker and go get a job and, and move the hell on. And I'm serious about that. That's the craziest, most wackadoo message I've ever heard in my life. And I'm serious as a heart attack about that. Many shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this. I mean, I'm not trying to be harsh, but I feel somebody needs to just hear, just hear it straight up. And I'm being serious about that. This is not, I mean, I'm not a harsh person. But if somebody goes to that great damn lengths to try to cause chaos in somebody's life when they didn't even agree to marry them in the first damn place, you're doing it to your damn self. This is what you're doing. And I'm serious. I heard many shocking series of shame events are about to occur with this. Well, I hope they go get a job. It's a shocking series of shame events that leave people the hell alone that don't even know they're in a marriage. And I'm serious.
community, upright. Number seven could be a very significant number in one's life. Number seven could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to, possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible green card number, possible social number, number seven. Someone's going to be very, very excited that this reading came out and take quick, quick action. Somebody's about to be very mortified that this reading came out and they're going to take quick action. Someone's about to move away from this very toxic city very soon and very quickly. And somebody's about to send communication, confirmation of hidden camera very soon and very quickly. Whoa, so you plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody's happy I'm delivering these channel messages. Somebody's not. Um, it might be that I feel the toxic water sign fan watches my channel. And I'm serious about that. I feel she does. There's a reason I'm pulling her in. She put another fan in a false marriage. Um, I just want to throw this out here, toxic water sign fan. Do you even know if this fire sign fan is gay? I mean, because it's a fem to fem relationship. I mean, I just would need to ask the burning questions up in here. And I'm serious. Do you even know if she's gay? Because if she's not gay, that could cause, a, that's causing a huge bag of worms too. Because that's going to cause one, a lawsuit. Because she didn't even agree to marry you. And two, you're trying to force somebody into a gay marriage and they're not even gay. I mean, just saying, just saying. So, you got to ask the burn. I mean, hell, got to ask the burning questions. Just saying, just saying. She most certainly is not gay, is what I just heard. Oh, my God. This is getting worse. Oh, my God. And she's not even gay? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is going on around here? Okay. So, she's not even gay, and you put her in a false marriage. Okay, water sign fam. It's getting weirder. It's getting crazier. It's getting out, out of control. It's getting out of control. You put a poor woman in a false marriage and she ain't even gay. Oh, you are a huge criminal. Huge ass criminal. Just saying, just saying. Huge ass criminal. Um, so, yeah. So, I heard somebody's going to be happy this, um, this, Reading came out. Well, I'm glad you're happy. Um, and somebody is going to be mortified and embarrassed. So I think it might be this gay water sign film. Um, she's either gay or bisexual. There's a reason she put this fire sign film in a false marriage. So she might be bisexual. Hell, she probably, she's probably displaying her goodies all around the community. She might be that toxic water sign film prostitute I've been pulling in for, for fucking forever. Possibly. I mean, I'm just saying, just saying. Um, but the fire sign theme she put in a false marriage, I heard is not gay. Just saying, just saying. So you plug it in how it resonates. So somebody's going to be very happy, send quick communication soon. That could be the, uh, I heard regarding the hidden camera. Um, kudos to you. I think you might be an air sign or a fire sign. Confirmation again. Come on. And somebody's going to be mortified. Um, and I heard they're going to travel away from the uh, toxic city very soon. Like, I'm feeling moving, moving from a toxic city. So that could be you moving from a toxic city or somebody you're connected to. But somebody's about to um, get very embarrassed and basically move away from a, a toxic city very soon. And somebody is about to um, send quick communication regarding a hidden camera. So we have action. That's the moving away from a toxic city very soon, very quickly. And the action of the sending the communication regarding a hidden camera soon um so you plug it in how it resonates you cannot run and you cannot hide somebody's about to be in the middle of a lawsuit very soon and very quickly oh my god i heard you cannot run and you cannot hide somebody's about to be in the middle of a lawsuit very quickly so a lawsuit energy traveling away from a toxic city very quickly and um quick communication regarding hidden camera in somebody's home very quickly Lots of action energy. Number 17 could be a very significant number in one's life. It could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to. 
possible lottery number, possible date of birth number, possible social um, social number, green card number, etc. Number 17. Holy crap, man. People are getting huge wake-up calls of what the real truth is now. About to be huge changes soon and quickly. Oh my God. I heard people are getting a huge wake-up call what the, about the real truth. What the real truth is now. Huge changes coming soon and quickly. So action all over the place. I feel action is the somebody going to get mortified and moving away from a toxic city quickly that could be you or somebody you're connected to or this toxic ass water sign that's been exposed i mean why would you do that to somebody that's like frauds or rust and i'm serious that's like frauds freaking or rust um the queen of fraud and she put somebody in a damn false marriage that ain't even gay that's that's um one you're taking trying to take away somebody's rights hey what if that person don't even want to be married and i'm serious about that there's probably a reason they're single you ever thought about that? Talks of water on them? And they're not even gay. What is going on? And um, I heard, um, so action of that, action of quick communication regarding a hidden camera and action because somebody has woken up, oh, woke up, not woken, that's not a word, woke up and seen the real truth. So that could be you waking up to see the real truth or somebody you're connected to. Man, this is 11.22 p.m. I'm supposed to be in bed. Let me see if I hear anything else. Good God am I. Okay, I didn't. I didn't. All right, I'm getting out of here, man. Somebody needs to hear. At least two people in the universe, I'm feeling, needs to hear this. At least two. Well, I think maybe more. Um, but you, you have to plug in your own individual life, however it resonates, if it resonates for you. Um, I would be one piece as hell if I was put in a false marriage. I'd sue the hell out of them too, especially because, you know, oh, because, you know, I, I just placed myself if I was in that situation. I'm not a gay person. I'm not gay. I don't down people that are gay. For sure, for sure. Not at all. I'm a daughter that's gay. Not at all. But am I gay? Hell to the his no. So I would be doubly upset if that happened to me. You know what I'm saying? And and imagine if that water sign fam, if the roles were reversed and somebody did that to the water sign fam. I don't think she'd appreciate that shit at all, at all, at all. She sounds like a really controlling fucking narcissist is what she sounds like. She needs to move on and go get damn jobs is what she needs to do. And I'm serious about that. All right. I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.